<laughs> yeah. Good. That was intense. Aww. Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> I've been dying to come to a chiropractor. Yeah. Oh, oh, that felt so good. Yeah. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> oh yeah. Mm. Oh. Oh. Wow. Oh. Oh. Was... Ooh, you're feeling that, huh? Yeah. Oh. Everything's loose. Right. Oh. Mm. Oh, much better. It puts extra strain on my hips. Unlock your full potential at Crack Addicts. I've been working a lot. I've been working on a lot of different things. Okay. I've been back to set. Okay, what do you do on set? I am a stunt woman and an actress. Mm. So a lot of stuff, everything from driving cars to pretending to drown to uh, okay. working with horses and weapons. You ride horses? And yeah, yes, wow. yes I do. How's that been for your body? Difficult, I have yeah. to say, okay. because as we've seen in the last footage yeah. that we did, I'm fully fused from top to bottom. So I had childhood scoliosis. I had severe scoliosis with um, 72 and 75 degree, I think it was. Anyway, severe scoliosis. And I was fused with the Harrington rods from top to bottom. And and basically that was when I was 13. So everything that I've done since then has been with the fusion. My spine, you know, doesn't compress or release really uh, yeah. on its own. So I take all the pressure and all the impact in like one area. Okay. So my hips get sore and I tend to overcompensate sometimes with different parts of my body. Neck is tight. Lower back is fine right now. I've been Good. doing a lot of lower back release. Okay, we're gonna work on all of this then. Neck, mm -hmm. upper back, shoulder, sound good? Yes. Did you, yeah. did you say something else? Your forearm or your hand or something? Yeah, so my forearm. Um, so additional to like being back to work, I'm also completing my program at HMI, College of Hypnotherapy. So okay. I've been doing a ton of online schooling. Yeah. And I feel like between constantly like looking at my monitor and mm. typing and writing and like just, and then also now being back in the gym and yeah. trying to work on like these muscles specifically, like upper body. Okay. Um, the combination of it has just put a ton of stress from my elbow yeah. down to the wrist. So let's get started. I'm gonna just do a quick exam on you. I know your body, you've been here, but I just wanna do a quick check because I feel like it's been a little bit since I've seen you. So it has. Your neck is a little bit compressed. All right, so we're gonna decompress you. We will use the Y strap today to pull, just stretch only, right? And then getting in here, I'm going to mm. loosen up the scar tissue build up here in your upper back. Trice or traps. You know, people call this a shoulder, but really our shoulder joint is here, but we can say shoulder here, right? Yep. And like you said, low back isn't really tight, which is surprising because you have <laughs> rods down your spine, but I don't know how you manage to keep that part loose. Sometimes when I work on the body, I get tuning into your energy field, okay? Mm, I like that. Usually happens on the first visit, more so than other visits, but today I'm getting something from you. Fun. You wanna know? Oh, of course I do. It feels like something related to moving or a big purchase or finance. So to me, that could signify either buying a home or moving or some type of investment. Do you relate to any of that? I have been thinking about what my next move will be for purchasing a home maybe in Hawaii. Wow. Okay, so that, I feel like you, you're kind of carrying that here. All right, okay. so that's good stress though. Right? Yeah, it's exciting. It feels like there's like momentum and movement going for a future. But maybe you're overthinking it or overstressing a little bit um, to the point where you're carrying it in your shoulders when you shouldn't be. <laughs> yeah, it could probably be, you know, you have the A where you're, your starting point and then okay. like B, it's mm -hmm. the in between where you're like, how do I get to B? Yeah. yeah. That's, that's the point that it, I'm probably carrying. It can be stressful for sure. It's yeah. a big move. A lot of steps to make it happen. So you like Hawaii that much, huh? I love it, yeah. I I don't think I'll ever fully decide. leave LA because yeah. this is where work is and my family yeah. and, mm -hmm. um, and I like you know, having my connections still here. It's a good home base, but I would like to split my time. But I'm I'm also open to seeing the other Sorry. islands. Let's see one more, I'm gonna hold it for you. Mm. 
Let's go this way. I want to be in an area where there's yeah. more land than people. So, okay. you know, there's other islands with more of that. I just, I think it just is like. So it's going to be like your tropical escape. Pretty much, but I'm also looking to do as much community service stuff as I can out there. No way. I don't like, think like it's, what? well, I would love to help the community out there with their entertainers and then oh. the people who are pursuing film but need more resources for training and yeah. education. You know, I do a lot of that work here in LA. I more. don't necessarily need the work in Hawaii, but I would love to create more opportunity for the people there who do. I also don't think that you should move to a place like that and not get back. Bring your head down towards your feet and then head up <gasps> and down. Oh, oh. Was, <laughs> was that your shoulder? Or yeah. Was that? Ooh, you've been working out? I have. Oh, I can feel it. Good. Head down. <laughs> head up. Five. Mm. You've been doing back workouts? Yes. Yep. Mm. A lot of rowing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Very good. Your body responds so quickly, though. I love it. It's so easy to work on you because it just loosens up super fast. Oh, that's great. Let's go here and then go behind your back, please, like that. Boom. Ba. Let's go five more. Holy moly. One more. Oof. Right there. Did you feel that? Yes. Man, you can take pain pretty well. How about right here? <laughs> <laughs> Five more. Yeah, actually, you actually feel pretty good in the upper cervicals. So this is a scar where the rods are. And what I want to do is I want to loosen up the muscles here. Her erectors and also her latissimus torsi. So go ahead and do a few of these guys like that. Bam. And I'm going to start here. The lat muscle is a huge muscle in the back. Oh. And I'm trying to just get the fascia oh. to release. And when the fascia releases, the entire back will start to open up and be less less crowded for her. Oh. And then I'll go a little deeper under the lat into her erectors. Oh. How are you doing there? Good. <laughs> <laughs> She's got high pain points, so she can handle this. Tight right here. This is her oh. her erector spiny muscle. Right in there. Whew. You okay? Mm -hmm. Give me like three more. I'm gonna focus a little more right in here. Oh. Three, two, <sighs> and one. Good job. Okay, now we're gonna get into first rib. So normally, after I open up the lats, I'd go in and adjust the mid back, but because she has rods, there's no adjusting going on through this part of her spine. But we can adjust here the first rib up top. Let your arms drop for me. Nice. One more time. Good. Good. Let's go on this side. Take the same thing. Deep breath in. Breathe out. I gotcha. Right there. Good. Okay. Into your hip stabilizers and your hip flexors. Just a little bit. Just loosen this part up. So let's have you kick back and forth like that. I'm going to hold you right here. Boom. Oh. There he's popping. Pop, pop, pop. Mm. Five more. Mm. So for this one, I'm getting into her hip flexors, but I'm also going to start here where her iliocecal valve is. Sometimes we can hear some bubbling, gurgling sounds. That's good. That means we are actually adjusting that part of the intestine. So just go ahead and relax and breathe for me. Did you hear that? Mm -mm. I heard it. They're like little white out. Okay, good. Now, we're just gonna get into your hip flexors a little more. For this, I'm gonna go here, here, and here. This should be a nice stretch. So lift your arm over your head like that. Breathe in for me. Breathe out. Do you feel a stretch there? Yes. Yes, yeah, she does. <laughs> good. That is the adjustment there. <laughs> Wow, I really hope we got that. Wow, that was sure cool. You did. That was Good nice. job. <laughs> Holy moly. Nice. Good job. You're really good at breathing and relaxing. Right in here. Take a deep breath in and out. 
Good. Slow immobilizing. Switch sides. How that feel? Good. Scoot back towards me a little bit. Boom, bop. Kick your legs back and forth, please. Bop. Repeat. Bla. Oh, tighter on this side, eh? Yeah. Oh, my back cracked. <laughs> that was you. That was me. Over your head, like so, and then I'm gonna come here into your hip flexor here. Breathe out for me. Release it, release it. There you go. Is that tender? Yeah. Wow. Very good. Ooh, how was that? Oh, that one's tight. Yeah, scoot towards me. Stop right there, straighten the bottom leg. And breathe out for me, I gotcha. So a little specific for you right there. Good, good. You okay? Here are the scalenes, the SEM, and the suboccipitals. Those are the top three neck muscles that I work on the most. Right here, we're in, right into the suboccipitals here. Just trying to mobilize it, break up the adhesions in there. Mm. Mm. This feels really nice. It's like a deep stretch, deep in the back of the head. Mm -hmm. How's that feel? Good. Mm. And come here. Mm. 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 Very nice. Now we're getting into scalenes. This way. Mm. So now I'm going to get into her scalings a little more. Uh, oh. Is that tender? Mm -hmm. Super tender. Yeah, it's really tender on people. But she can handle it, so I'm going to keep grinding on it. She can take it. She's used to it. See, the right side's way better than the left. Do you, do you feel a difference? Yes. It's probably still tender, but maybe not as much. And of course, we're going to go all the way into the attachment points here by the rib. Keep doing it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could do it on myself. Very nice. Very nice. Look at that. It's already, I mean, it's already slim. It's crazy. Not that that's the point, uh, but it's a nice little side thing that comes with it. That's always the point. <laughs> oh, okay. I didn't know that body. Not all of us have the genetic Korean jawline that you have, <laughs> Dr. K-pop. Uh, now that her muscles are loosened up, we can do some adjusting. So bring your ear to your right shoulder for me. And then we got one right there. I gotcha. Slide your head to the left. Oh. Oh. <laughs> wow. <sighs> I feel like you just put my head back in the right place. Yeah. <laughs> and we got two more up top. Let's see one. And then this is occiput. So same thing, slide your head towards my left hand. Mm -hmm. That was deep in there. Mm -hmm. I felt that in my right eyeball. <laughs> Literally, like, I feel it right in here. Wow. So we're done with the neck adjustments, but we're going to use the live strap to traction her. No adjustment because we don't want to adjust down to her thoracic or lumbar spine, but we just want to stretch out her entire spine. Just nice, good traction. But before we do that, let's check your jaw. How's your jaw? I don't know. Go ahead and open your mouth for me. Okay, not bad. Open. I feel like it's a little tiny bit restricted. So let's do this. Go ahead and open for me. Close. Open. Ow. Mm. Mm. And then for this, you're gonna shut your jaw like an underbite. Yep, repeat. Mm. Mm -hmm. Really tight right here on the right side, yeah? Mm -hmm. One more time, please. Breathe in real big and relax it. Really relax these muscles. There you go. Now, I'm gonna check the, the, mm. the joint of your jaw here. Open your mouth for me and then just relax it. Yeah, it actually feels good. So we don't need to do anything. And then how about here, open here. Same, it's moving good. So now go ahead and open your mouth. Yeah, a little more, huh? How does it feel for you? Yeah, Okay. Good. actually, that's wild. Let's do this. You're just stretching only. And I want you to do some nice deep breathing. And I'm just leaning my my whole body weight back and just allowing her body to stretch 
at her own pace. And if you look, her neck is slowly starting to elongate, slowly starting to get longer. How about maybe three more, just like that, Michelle? How was that? Good. I could feel it like in my upper back, which is nice. I'm in your extremities. I don't think we've done this before. No, we haven't. Okay. You need tightness through here. Definitely in the chest because I have scar tissue right there, right now. Okay. Let's get in there. Good job. Why do you just take it? Why don't you tell me that it hurts? Because I like it when it hurts. <laughs> My type of patient. <laughs> <laughs> oh, something already popped. Right there. Ooh. It's a little baby one. Yeah. If I had done it, it would, I think it would have been louder, but I just, I was kind of seeing how you would react. You scratch your knuckles? Mm -hmm. Pretty game? Yeah, you did. <laughs> nice. Love it. That hand one felt so good. The wrist? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Let's do the shoulder on this side. Yep, kind of leave it like that and come in. Right there. And I have to distract you. Aww. Oh. Oh. Did you feel that? Yeah. Oh, that felt so good. Yeah. Kind yeah. Of gives you a little space. Yeah. Did you feel it in your clavicle or? or? Uh, behind. Behind. Yeah. Great. Let's do your hips. I don't think we've ever done the hips either. No. Like this. First. And then squeeze your knees together really hard. <laughs> it's like immediate. Wow. wow. <laughs> You're popping the places that. We haven't done it. Okay. Obviously, they needed it. That was great. Let's do the hip pull. I think you're gonna like this one too. Mm -hmm. So relax, relax, relax. Give it to me. I gotcha. <gasps> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't warn you. Yeah, I'm basically yanking your hip. Did you feel that? Yes. How'd you feel? Everything. <laughs> Got the egg away scraper, and I'm gonna put a little bit of CBD, and we're gonna like scrape. A fascia scraper. Yeah, and then we're gonna kind of, it's it's heated too. We're gonna scrape through here. Okay, so I'm gonna apply a little bit of lotion. And this guy on. So how does that feel? I'm gonna go gradually. I'm gonna gradually go gradually deeper, but how does that feel right now? Ooh, you're feeling that, huh? Yeah. Mm, that's nice. Uh, let's go here. How does that feel? Good. Do you feel it? Mm -hmm. Do you feel the heat? Mm -hmm. Okay, how was that? Nice. Yeah, your neck definitely looks longer. My neck feels way better. Yeah. Like whatever was compressed feels like open now. Let me just check what I'm feeling here. Okay. That's good. Wow, okay, there's a couple, there's a lot. <laughs> what are these noises? I'm, I'm excited, there's a lot. There's a lot of information today. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna start because there, it's all over the place. But, a lot of tension? Yes, but let me tell you what it's from. Okay. okay. There's four things. First thing I feel has to do with your father. Oh. Second thing I feel has to do with your partner or a oh. future partner. And the third thing I feel has to do with work, ah. finance. And the fourth thing I feel is, I just get this feeling that when you were younger, someone was very hurtful in the things they said to you, or you were very sensitive to perhaps uh, criticism or something along those lines that kind of got lodged in your neck. Does wow. any of that resonate? All of that resonates. 
<laughs> I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> I wasn't either. <laughs> no, but that's uh, good. That's great. Okay. The reason why things like this come up is mm -hmm. because we carry all of this in our bodies, as you can imagine. Yeah. And when I work, I like to address those things so that we can release on a physical, but also on an emotional, energetic level as well. Just. And then go slowly back. All the way back. Good. Let's go look straight forward. And then I want you to rotate your head to the left. Okay. Rotate to the right. Your range is pretty good so far. Range of motion. A little restricted there on the right. I feel that. Uh, look straight. And then this time, let's go ear to your shoulder. And then how about the other way? Slightly restricted. Okay. So what I'm going to do is we're going to release the traps here and work on muscles here. Okay. So let's start by going side to side. Okay. And then repeat. Okay. Go ahead. Oh, the other thing that I didn't tell you was that I can tell that you're extremely intuitive. You're very connected to... I'm kind um, of like an empath. I definitely yes. feel everything yep. around me. I'm there affected by that for sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Took the words out of my mouth. <laughs> You're a musician? I am. Is that your creative outlet to exactly. channel all of that? I'm not very good with speaking about my feelings, so I kind of just write about them. Mm. Sort of that we mentioned, are they related to each other? Yeah, I would say so. Okay, what's going on? Honestly. Obviously, you're carrying a lot of attention about Yeah. Things. Yeah, work is definitely a big one of those. Okay, what's going on? So although I, I am a musician, Yeah. I work in commercial advertising. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. It's very demanding. Mm -hmm. And just trying to climb that ladder mm. and work for somebody else when you're kind of an entrepreneur. Sure. It's tough. Yeah. <laughs> it's definitely tough. Give me two more. Okay. Ooh, right here. Super tight. That's so funny how it's like harder for me to even mm -hmm. move. <laughs> kind of the situation you're in. You have, you know, like a corporate job, mm -hmm. um, but in the meantime, you're sort of, you have another way of, you know, you're an entrepreneur, a musician, and you're trying to do something else. It's almost like we, we kind of have to live double lives while we're doing that, right? Completely. Especially That's literally it. trying to survive in this modern age of crazy inflation, no more middle class. Mm -hmm. Let's go here. Switch. And one aspect is very left brain, and the other aspect is very right brain. Mm -hmm. Which could work if you just, you know, find, find a good balance, balance right? Yeah. How are you doing so far? Good. Good. It feels really good. <laughs> yep. So now relax your arm, bring your head all the way down towards your feet, head up, repeat. Yeah, yeah, I can tell that. Mm. So good. Do you get massages? I do. I love massages. Okay. <laughs> um, I, what do they say? You're super tight every time? Always. You go? Always. Mm -hmm. I always say, relax, relax. Yeah. And remind me, have you been to a chiropractor before? I have not. First time. First, First time. First timer. Oh, boy. I've been dying to come to a chiropractor, yeah? though. So, okay. very glad to be here. Oh, I'm honored to. Hopefully offer a good experience for your first time. Adjustments, okay. Sounds good. Uh, for the Feels and... great. Okay, I'm gonna start off with this mid-back release. I'm gonna raise you up and we're gonna kind of do a little traction here. Okay. So you're going to interlock your hands behind your neck. Was that your shoulder? Yeah. <laughs> Perfect, okay, elbows in and then fall back. Yep. But bring your elbows in more. Yep. And then try to relax if that makes sense. And then like you're laying on a bed. Okay. Oh, there he goes. Yes. <laughs> oh my God. How's that? Nice. That yes. Good? Yeah. Let's do this side first. This side's a little tight. Come this way. Yeah, I'm going to. I know this is really weird, but this is actually a. Do your thing. Do your it's thing. It's actually kind of. Com it should be comfortable for you because I'm sort of bracing you like that. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes. 
Mm. Is that okay? Absolutely. Good. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> I definitely <laughs> needed this. Okay, let's have you go face down. Please. Give me like five more. Okay. For this, I want you to go towards the floor like that. Bam. Okay. Bam. Repeat. Oh. Uh, yes. Was something crack? Yeah. Oh, shit. You gotta save those. Like five more. Five. Four. Three. Oh. Everything is cracking. There's <laughs> no. Not good. Have you ever had someone pull your skin? No. <laughs> on you? Sure. Does that sound weird? That sounds a little weird, but I'm I'm down. You're the doctor. <laughs> it actually kind of feels nice. It feels like human skin bubble wrap. Oh, okay. Sounds interesting. <laughs> what does this do exactly? Hold on. Oh. Oh. Does that hurt? Oh, no, <laughs> not at all. Is it kind of weird? It's no, it's, it's definitely a little weird actually, but. There it is. So I want to release it. Take a deep breath in. Breathe out. Good, I got you. I'm going to just turn my head a little like this. Good. Oh. You okay? Yes. It's really, really stiff. I'm trying to get you on this side. Take a deep breath in. Turn your head a little. Breathe out. Right there. Good. Kick your leg back and forth like that. Okay. I'm gonna get it right here. Ready? Go. Up. Yep. <laughs> now this one is your hip flexor, but we also sometimes get it right here where you have your iliocecal valve right here, which is where your large intestine is and sometimes we hear a we get a, we get an adjustment there okay so relax here i want you to just breathe oh did you hear that yeah i really went breathe good i want you to breathe a little more good okay so for this i'm going to i'm going to stretch it out we're going to get deep into the head flexor now I need you to breathe in a little big. Really, you'll like the stretch. You feel that? Absolutely. Yeah. Do you do like box jumps and stuff? Uh, I haven't in a while, but I used to have a trainer. I can tell. <laughs> Body never lies. Breathe out. I got gotcha. you. You're not gonna fall. Oh, wow. <laughs> Wasn't ready for that, but I felt really good. That was like clunky. It was like, Burr. I really needed this. Yeah. Like, I really did. Holy. Holy, holy. Let's go that way. Do you cross your right leg over your left? Yeah, I do. That tends to be the side you favor. And you know what? Actually, this hip, yeah. like, it, it gets stuck sometimes. It's weird. Like, if I, like, oh. Do hip openers, yeah. like my hip will like click. Okay. Relax. <laughs> Breathe in for me. Oh, excellent. Come back up. Uh, let's do this side. Hey, so that was your second adjustment, the lower back. Straighten your bottom leg. Right? So this would be your third. This would be number three. Take a deep breath in. Breathe out. I got you. You won't fall. Yeah. There it is. Oh. That was a lot. <laughs> How was that? That was your third adjustment ever in your life. That was really good. Yeah. Like I really felt that like up yeah. my spine. Yeah. <laughs> Every time it cracks, I'm just like yes. Your scalene muscles here. Let me know if it's too much. Let me know if it hurts too much. Should be hurt so good. Yeah, it's a good hurt so far. Okay. So curious, um, mm -hmm. going back to what we talked about earlier, mm -hmm. first thing that came up was your dad. Are you worried about him? Is there anything going on with him? Um, not particularly at the moment, but okay. we've kind of always had a rough relationship. Got it. And then how about your partner? 
You have a partner right now? No partner right now. Okay. But it's definitely an area. That you want to manifest. Yes. Interesting. Oh yeah, I imagine they definitely all affect each other. Mm. This feels so good. Yeah. Mm. What was that? That's your scaling muscle. Oh wow. This is really tight. Mm. Yeah. Wow. I like felt that in my shoulder. Good. Now here, this is your suboccipital muscle here. Okay. When it's tight, it can cause headaches, dizziness, and migraines. Interesting. You have any of that? I've been having a lot of dizziness lately. Oh wow. Okay. So it's coming from here. Oh. Is it tolerable? Yeah. Barely? No, it feels good. Okay. Let me know if it's too much. Okay. Mm. Let's check your jaw. Let's see if you... Ah, not bad. As long as I can remember. Okay, go ahead and open your mouth. Close it. Again. How does that feel? I just... It feels fine. There's just like a small click. Click. Okay, is it okay if we work on this a little? Sure. Go ahead and open your mouth. Close and repeat. Okay, now I'm gonna get here. Go ahead. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Give me like five more. I don't know if you can tell, but your jaw tends to deviate that way mm -hmm. when you open. All right, go ahead and open your mouth. So, what I'm trying to do is get it to go back. Not, yeah. So, now from here, you're gonna jut your jaw like an underbite. Mm hmm Close it. Repeat it. Mm hmm Yeah, like five more. Is that tender? Mm hmm mm, Very much so. <laughs> okay, now five more here. Uh, mm hmm Four. Three. Good. Last but not least, I'm going to check to see how your joint is moving. So open your mouth here. I'm just going to press here, okay? Stuck. Not as bad on the left side. Your right side is stuck. Yep, just relax it. So open it, but relax it. Yep. So you're gonna feel a little pop here. Right there. Yep, good. Oh, wow. I can definitely feel the click. I, it's definitely more subtle for sure. Yeah. How that even happens you probably clench your teeth clench your jaw you probably clench you probably grind you hold your tension um, mm. you might chew more on the right side but yeah we can do more next time Ooh, good job that was cool okay now let's get to your neck um okay. we remember this side would not it was this side the first side didn't adjust very well okay so we just got a few more how you doing brother you all right you yeah i'm doing there? great this is fantastic <laughs> So I got one right here, and I want you to bring your ear towards your right <laughs> shoulder. <laughs> so it. neck adjustments, they sound loud because they're right by the ear, but they should feel like a good relief, good release. Absolutely. So we'll just check. We already got this side up top, so this side is all good, but I feel some tightness here on the left. So you're going to slide your head towards your left shoulder. Give it to me a little more. <laughs> Oh. That's the good stuff. <laughs> I need a moment. <laughs> that, what is process. Yeah, this is interesting. Like how did because you seem like very in tune with energy as well. Like as soon yeah. as I came in, you've kind of read me mm -hmm. off mm -hmm. very on point. Mm -hmm. So how does it affect you giving people adjustments and releasing their energy? Good question. <laughs> <laughs> I have to make sure that I'm grounded. I have to make sure that I clear and, and cleanse as well. And I have to have a very specific type of lifestyle so that I'm not taking that home with me all the time or that I'm not muddled and not being able to hear and be clear. So yeah, it affects me, but not like 
in a harmful way or anything, as long as I'm doing my part. Right. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. Yeah, thanks for asking. Do you want to try the wise trap? What is it? Do you want to try the wise trap where we make you taller? Okay. <laughs> Are you trying to get to 5'9"? Yeah. Why? <laughs> Just always wanted to be a little taller. Everyone always says that. And actually, I wouldn't mind either. <laughs> right? Okay, so for this, I want you to take a nice deep inhale and really let your joints relax. You'll feel a little bit of attraction. Starting now, and I want you to breathe in real big and out. Good, exactly, just like that, okay? Keep up that type of breathing. And I want you to relax your chest. See if you can let that chest sort of drop down and you'll feel a little pop. <laughs> Yeah. Yep. I did a really, really, really light adjustment on you. Really, really subtle. It did not feel light. Where did you feel it? I can feel it like in my upper back. Did, did it go down? Yeah. Yeah. It, it did not feel light at all. <laughs> I gotcha. No? Okay. I'm afraid to crack my knuckles. Why? I don't know. You don't like the sound of it? It just. I don't know, it scares me. <laughs> I know people like that. Okay, let's try the other side. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Yes, thank you. Knuckles have not been cracked in ages. Yes. <laughs> Okay, you said your right hip was tight, yeah? Yeah. This one's gonna kind of open you up a little. I think you'll like this one. You just, just relax, I gotcha. Relax, relax, let it. I have a hard time relaxing. Yeah, I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> I heard that. Yeah, did you feel it? it? Yeah, definitely did something. Okay, same thing here. Just let it fall. Survived. Yes. How do you feel? I feel really good. 